In the previous video, I have uh, shown you how you can uh, configure uh, the Greylock sidecar for Windows using uh, Winlock Bit. This time, I'm going to show you how you can uh, do it on Linux. For this test, I will simply use the Greylog uh, server to get the logs for. And in our case, we have an uh, RPM package. And we can download uh, this one right here. We can uh, right click it, copy the link, go to the terminal. And we can do, let's see in which directory we are. And we will download the RPM package. using uh, wget okay we have it here let's go back to the instruction page and uh, let's follow it uh, and we have nx log on centos no not nx log let's do where it installed the sidecar on centos so we have this one right now we will uh, install the package okay it doesn't work let's do rpm yeah uh, we have the latest package which is 1011 and here is 100 to something so we are going to do rpm minus i and then gray log and install it after it's installed we will um, do a service install then we will uh, enable the service so we will do instead of start here we will gonna put enable and right now we will gonna start the process we can uh, check it and it's down uh, because yeah we will need to configure it so let's go to Etsy gray log and this time we will do sidecar okay and let's configure the YAML file here in the server URL we will need to put HTTPS and then the IP address of our gray log 10.168.184.139 right now we will need to put in the token and since we don't have the token we will have to create a new token and you can see it I went here create or use a token for gray log sidecar so I'm gonna do Linux this time create the token we will copy the clipboard we will copy the token to the clipboard and paste it in right here um, and then let's do the TLS let's keep the TLS verification we will gonna put this one to true and delete the hashtag in front of it then save it let's try to restart the gray lock sidecar right now in theory it should work without any problem and it does let's go back to gray log and this time we will gonna go to sidecars configuration uh, we will gonna use a file bit on Linux and for this one 
we would also need to download FileBit. So we will have uh, FileBit. This is the download page, the official download page. And for uh, FileBit, we have RPM64. So I'm going to copy this one. Ah, or we can install it with YAM. So let's try to install it with YAM. We already have the, um, the Elasticsearch repository. So we will going to download FileBit using this one. YAM install FileBit. Just like this. Currently, we have uh, Elasticsearch version 6 running, so we, it will gonna download FileBit 6.8 version. So let's agree with the download and the installation of the FileBit. Everything is complete. We don't need to do anything else. We don't need to configure anything for FileBit because we will gonna push the configuration from Graylog. We will just have to restart the Greylock sidecar yeah and it's okay it's working uh, actually restart not start because it's already started yeah and it's like one second ago then we will gonna go to Greylock and do the following we will gonna check here file bit on linux we will gonna do an edit and we will gonna leave it to the default the template we will just need to change the ip address right here to match the one for Greylock that we have okay update it we will go back and here we will gonna create a configuration let's call it linux let's change the color uh, the collector will be file bit on linux this is the config that we will gonna push and we will gonna click on create it's created let's go to administration right now and as you can see we have the file bit for sidecar and we will push this configuration to the agent over here you can see it with question mark so started to run we can also click on process and then start and this uh, sign here change from question mark to play button let's go to overview and we can see it here running for linux right now let's check the messages to see if we receive them or if we have received something and we actually did so this is basically the configuration for sidecar regarding linux in streams we can go to sidecar and here if we want we can uh, filter by let's do the last 30 minutes and let's filter by bits type let's generate some quick values and we have file bit which is running on linux on Greylog, actually on the Greylog server and winlog bit which is running on the windows 10 machine thanks for watching don't forget to subscribe hit the like button if you like the video share it and talk to you guys in the next one